In this video, we'll write the Lewis structure for PBr4+. Plus. The first thing we need to do to write the Lewis structure is figure out how many valence electrons we have for PBr4+. Plus. So we can look on the periodic table, and that'll help us figure it out. If we look for phosphorus, it's right here. It's in group 5A, sometimes called 15, 5 valence electrons. Bromine, that's right here in group 7. 7A has 7 valence electrons, sometimes called group 17. Here's your bromine. That has seven, but we have four bromines. So we'll multiply that by four. And then we have this positive sign. When we see a positive sign, that means that we've lost an electron. So electrons are negative. If you lose an electron, you become positive. So we've lost one electron. So this is 28, 33, minus one, 32 total valence electrons for the PBr4 plus Lewis structure. Phosphorus, that's the least electronegative. We're going to put that right there at the center, and then we'll put bromines around it. We have 32 total valence electrons, so we're going to put electrons between the atoms, and that'll form the chemical bonds. Once we're done with that, we'll put electrons around the outside of these bromine atoms to complete their octets, keeping in mind we only have 32 valence electrons. So at this point, we've used all 32 valence electrons. If you add these up, it adds up to 32. Everything has octets. The phosphorus has an octet, each bromine, it has an octet. So this is the Lewis structure for PBr4+. We should add brackets, though, to show that it's an ion. And then we'll put our plus sign outside. So that's it. This is the Lewis structure again for PBr4+, and this is Dr. B. Thanks for watching.